Hey everyone, it's Dina, and this is the eyeliner that I'm doing today. Okay, I'm using the Wet n Wild Mega Liner uh, Liquid Eyeliner in black. It's a uh, 861, and uh, let's begin, I guess. Okay, a lot of times you'll get a lot of extra goop, so I usually dab off just a touch on the back of my hand. <clears throat> Excuse me, my throat is still dry. But um, what I do is I just try to make it a really good sharp point. And then I begin in the middle of the eye, and that's where most of my uh, eyeliner is actually going to go. Where all the goop, and I go as close as I can. Uh, to the eye to the eyelashes. Okay, and I don't go all the way in because my eyes get so watery at times. So I'll go all the way to the end of the eyelashes, like about there. Like that. Okay, and then I don't go all the way. I usually out, uh, outline the eye first, and then I start to fill it in. I don't go all the way to the corner, though. Okay. And then I fill it all in, all the way into the eyelashes. And I get more product. Hopefully you can see. Okay, and that doesn't have to be perfect because that's not even close to what we're doing. Okay, I'm going to explain to you what I'm trying to accomplish. Uh, since my eyes are um, are like larger on the top and smaller on the bottom, see the shape of my eye? It's it's more on top than it is on the bottom. So I'm trying to make it appear more uh, cat eye like and a little higher. So I always aim for my um, for the wing to be right into the uh, corner, into the crease of the eye. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> but I try to go there is what I'm at attempting. And I try to just have like an invisible line to about where my uh, eyebrows kind of end. So like that side. Just kind of hold it all up. Just kind of lift it all up. Lift your eyes up. And I uh, wipe off more product because we don't want a lot on the tip. And I stay inside. I don't go all the way to the edge of the eye. See there? See how that's not all the way? And then I just slowly fill it in until it's just all the way across. Until it goes all the way across. And I'm so much more nervous since I'm doing the video. See how that kind of looks curved, it kind of curls out? The whole purpose of, um, let's see if I can talk and do this at the same time. Okay, that's a little bit better. But the whole purpose of uh, doing eyeliner is to make your eyelashes appear thicker. I'm having a hard time talking today. Appear thicker and fuller and you're uh, reshaping your your eye to create the perfect eye that you want to create, I guess. Maybe to enhance your eyes to make them bigger, smaller, however you want to do. So, if you have uh, less droopy eyelids, then you can create a longer uh, eyeliner, a wing. So that's about, I'm going to leave it at that. See that? that. So, pretty even. And then I take my uh, edge brush, which you've seen, Smashbox, and I dip it in a black uh, eyeshadow. I'm using my Chanel, you've seen it before, the Smoky Eye Quad. I'm using that and I'm just dipping it in a little bit and I'm just setting that in case I missed any little spots. Okay. There we go. All right, so that's what I do. And right now I've got brown under the eye and a little bit of black eyeliner. I've already lined uh, all my waterline. Make sure that you water both, or uh, line both your water lines and top line. So yeah, so I'm gonna curl my eyelashes and apply mascara. 
I'm using a, a new foundation today, that new Photo Finish Revlon, and I think the color is way too light for me. I'm using vanilla, and it's just having a, I need a new foundation desperately. I've heard so many good rays, but this is just too light. It tends to pick up every little fleck on my face. My face is just so dry. Okay, I'm using Zoom Lash by MAC. I may use the Coverall length, lengthening too, I don't know. I'm gonna start from the bottom. I'm gonna close my eyelashes, that's just what I do. I guess I do more of the work than the wand does. Just, and see how goopy it gets at times? That's okay. I just use two. I really love the idea of this. I've seen so many people use two. But this here just cleans it all up. Separates the eyelashes. See, look at that. Plus, while the other coat is drying, I can work with it. Like that. Okay. I meant to do the bottom before I did this tutorial. Okay, so that's basically the look. I have not done the other arm, but for the sake of this video, I'm going to go ahead and cut it off short. So yeah, hopefully you, you all enjoyed this look, and I will see you all later. Bye!